All right, today I'm going to teach you people how to turn a box inside out. So, once you have a box similar to this, or even to this, you're going to want to turn it inside out. Now, the most important reason we're turning these inside out is because it would take a whole lot of paint to paint over this to cover all of this up, or you would have to wrap it like a present. An easy way to fix that is just to turn this box inside out. Now it sounds complicated, but it really is not. So the first thing you're going to do is open the box. Open both ends. And then you're going to find the side that has the tab. So go ahead and take any inside parts out. Oh, that's cool. We could use that later. So if you look inside, you find the corner with the tab. So see this tab right here? You're going to very gently pull that tab to where the whole box opens. So now you have a funky looking piece that looks kind of like this. Hopefully it'll adjust in just a second. There we go. And now you're going to simply turn it inside out. So I'm just going to fold this tab the other way so that it'll fold easily in just a second. So now that I have that ready, I'm just going to pull this around, crease those sides because it's not used to folding this way. Crease all these tabs the opposite way. All right, so now I'm going to turn it inside out. I'm going to put this tab either on the inside or on the outside. If you put it on the outside like this, you can flip this over and put a little bit of hot glue right here. Or you can put it on the inside. I'm going to put mine on the inside, so I'm going to take a piece of tape. That'll work. I'm going to stick the tape to where... stuck on that side of the tab. So now when I fold this over and press, I'm basically sticking that tape to the inside of my box, trying really carefully to line that up. All right. So now I have that part lined up. I can come down here and fix this part again. And then I can come to the top like that, and simply close it. And so now I have flipped my box inside out and I'm ready to go decorating. I can leave it white if I want to or I can paint it. Now that it's white, I won't have to use near as many coats of paint as I would have had to in the first place. You can simply even just draw on it if you choose. It is totally up to you. But now it is a blank canvas and you're ready to go to create whatever kind of house you want. Ta-da!